everybody. My name is Sarah. Welcome to Kids Following Jesus. So this is kind of a loaded question. Have you ever been bad? Have you ever said or done something that was mean? Told a lie? Taken something that wasn't yours? Have you ever had something bad happen to you? Maybe your best friend didn't want to be your friend anymore? You could probably think of a few things. How did that make you feel? Were you sad or angry? Did you feel lost or alone? Well, in the Bible, there's a book called Ezekiel. And in Ezekiel's time, the people were being very bad. They were not following what God wanted for them. And unfortunately for them, the people who were supposed to be leading them and showing them how they should live were actually stealing from them and lying to them. So not only were the people being bad, but bad things were happening to them because the leaders there were so terrible. They were doing a terrible job of being a leader. Now, in the story, the people are referred to as sheep. So if you think of all of us here in the world are sheep. Now, God sent these leaders and they were supposed to be shepherding the people. And a shepherd is someone who watches over sheep. You're supposed to take care of them, uh, you know, keep them all together. And the shepherds that Jesus and God had sent onto the earth were just awful at what they were supposed to be doing. So in the story, God decides he will be our shepherd. Let's turn in our Bibles. We'll go to Ezekiel chapter 34. And we're going to read verse 11 through 16 to see what God says about being a shepherd for his sheep. The Lord and King says, I myself will search for my sheep. I will look after them. A shepherd looks after his scattered flock when he is with them, and I will look after my sheep. I will save them from all of the places where they were scattered on a dark and cloudy day. I will bring them out from among the nations. I will gather them together from other countries. I will bring them into their own land. They will eat grass on the mountains of Israel. I will also let them eat in the valleys and in all of the places in the land where people live. I will take care of them. In the best grasslands, they will eat grass on the high mountains of Israel. There they will lie down in the finest grasslands they will eat grass in the best places on Israel's mountains. I myself will take care of my sheep. I will let them lie down in safety, announces the Lord and King. I will search for the lost. I will bring back those that have wandered away. I will bandage the ones that are hurt I will make the weak ones stronger. I will destroy those that are fat and strong. I will take good care of my sheep. I will treat them fairly. So this week with Thanksgiving coming up, I want you to take time to reflect on the things that may make you wander away from what God wants from you, that might make you feel lost. And then I want you to consider the way that God is a shepherd for you and also the people that he has given you to help shepherd, such as your parents, your friends, or your teachers, and be thankful. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for being our shepherd and taking care of us. Help us see the things we do that lead us away from you. 
Help us see you leading us back to be close to you again. Amen. Thank you for joining me for Kids Following Jesus. We'll see you next week.